Hi, this is this is Pat with Pat's Two Cents, and I want to share something with you. I had a weird dream. Now, in this dream, because I do dream about demons, I see demons when I'm awake at times. Not often, but enough. And in this dream, I felt like it was a warning for those of you who are involved in relationships where one person is very domineering, very controlling, very mean-spirited, very abusive, very possessive and jealous, and suffocating. And what the Lord showed me was the demon behind it. In this dream, this one person was trying to break away from this other person. And while they were trying to break away, all of the friends were trying to help out. But the person who was being broken away from was the abusive one. And they were so mean and so abusive. And they were doing everything they could to hinder this person from leaving, from breaking the relationship. They were threatening, they were, they were teasing, they were just, just all over. They just wouldn't shut up. They were intimidating the whole nine yards. And I remember getting upset with the person who kept trying to reason with them. Because I said, look, either you want to stay or go, but we're not going to sit here and want to leave more than you do. So what ended up happening, I know my glasses look weird, but I have a weak eye and I have the glass that's over the weak eye. This I don't need any help. But anyway, every once in a while this eye gets a little weak. So if it looks weird, that's why. So what ended up happening is this person, the one that was abusive, that wouldn't let go, at one minute they look like an old person, old, mean, decrepit. And then on the other hand, they were young, vibrant, and attractive. Either way, their personality, their demeanor, their attitude was ugly, extremely threatening, extremely domineering, and I couldn't figure out what the heck is this? Why won't they just get out of the way? And then the Lord showed me the demon behind it. And I almost want to call it a demon of suffocation. This is why. Check this out. This demon, <laughs> this demon did not have a face like you or I would. They didn't have a normal looking head with a normal looking neck. And they had shoulders. But half the shoulders and the top half of the chest was covered. The chest, the neck, the face, the head, the ears, the hair, everything was covered with sea barnacles, with, with starfish, with shellfish, crabs, lobster. I mean, every kind of clams, everything that, that latches on and clenches. The whole thing was covered with that. And I, the first thing that came to my mind is, what a suffocating condition. So I don't know if it's a demon of suffocation, but whoever you are, you need this warning. You need to get out of there. Because what this demon's desire is, what the design on you is, that they are to latch on you and suck the life out of you. And they want you to stay there and serve their purposes. Remember, we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against wickedness in high places, etc. So you have to take your freedom. Don't wait for them to let go. You let go for both of you and get the heck out of Dodge while you still have a will of your own, a mind of your own or else they will drive your spirit out and you will never let go and you will never live out your life according to God's will or your heart's desire because everything you do will be about what serves their purpose 
And this demon is behind that person. So you be very careful. That's your warning. Get out while you can.